what's up guys today we are going to be working on billy jack has srt8 we're doing twin turbos on as you can see and we've vented the intake and we've also put vents in all right hard to see where we're trying to get this in together valve covers so we're gonna make a custom overflow catch can we're gonna put it right here um we'll make it use these tabs right here that way it's no bolts in it everywhere and uh kind of clean it up we'll put a in fittings uh, we got 10 a in lines and everything both valve covers so uh let's see what we'll see what kind of tank we can come up with we don't have much room right here to work with because we're gonna have a pipe that comes down through here down through this hole so we've got this little space right here to work with um where we're putting the turbo 400 swap in here we're probably going to go ahead and put the vent for the transmission run it up to this tank also that way we don't have a bunch of tanks everywhere all the lines go to one spot he has one drain so uh Let's get to work. Alright guys, so apparently the camera died when they were making this, so uh, here's the finished product. So it'll fit right down inside there. This bung right here is going to be for my transmission overflow. Then I got three bungs here, one for the vent out of the intake, one for each valve cover. Got a drain's going to go on the bottom. So here's where my filter's going to go, we'll cut that down, make it look nice, put the slip filter on it. It should sit right in there, right where the coolant overflow tank goes. Got a deal on the back it in. That way it'll slide right down into the on the car. So uh, let's get this back piece trimmed off here so the filter will fit and we'll get it put in there for a 100% test fit. So uh, let's go cut this off. We'll go back here to the bandsaw and cut this down a little bit and then we'll put the hole in it and then we'll, uh, yeah, we'll be ready to go. All right, guys, we got this product done, the catch can. So we're done now, got the filter on it. So let's put it in. Say so we're gonna use these tabs. We're gonna line up. This plans are made. Push it down in there. All right, all the way down. Good and solid. Filter, plenty of clearance all the way around. Like I said, our lines. Go from here to here, here to here, here, up and around to this one. We should be good to go. Put transmission, put a 90 out of it, run it back down through the transmission to where it's at for the vent. So should be good to go. Um, let us know if anybody would be interested in purchasing these. We think we're going to start selling them. Um, they'll work on any Dodge Challenger Magnum 300. Um, charger i don't know if i said that already or not i don't remember but these will be for sale um give me a couple days figure out prices and then i'll let everybody know and uh we'll start making them to sell them so uh that's it for a uh, this quick video I wanted to just go through and make that tank sorry camera died you know, i didn't get to see everything but uh stay tuned we're definitely going to be going building more video and more as we're building this twin turbo challenger so stick with us Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Turn on those post notifications. 
and roll the outro.